Hello everyone, this is Count Zero, and I am returning to Mass Effect 3. I'm doing streaming this time just on Twitch. I've been running into issues with the Restream IO chat software and me being not entirely sure that it's working. So anyway, yeah. Last time we left off, we wrapped up with two different options available for what to do with the galaxy, basically. We have two different factions to choose from with missions to help prove the cause. We have the Turians. Turians. So, for a second. So, Colonel, we have different options here. We have Shanka, a mission for the Krogans. And, or a mission for the Turians and Tuchanka, and a mission for the Attican Traverse with the Krogans. In addition, we put a bunch of other missions here. Um, so, the Dranic system. Let's get some more side force, side troops on our side. Then also we have gotten a new ally on board the ship. In addition to, to a Torian ambassador, we now have our old buddy Rex, who is here. Hell of a show down there on Sir Cash. just like the old days, Shepard. Right down to me pulling your ass out of the fire. I was the one with bullets flying at me. And I gave you the moral support to dodge them. Uh-huh. <laughs> you said one of your squads is missing. They were scouting out the Rachni relay. We've heard rumors of trouble in the area. Rachni? Thought that might get your attention. I have a favor to ask. It's big. Don't tell me they're back. All I know for sure is our scouts went silent as soon as they arrived. Yep. I've got Arlac Company, my best unit, on standby. You give the word, and they'll meet you there. I'll see what I can do. Get on it, Shepard. How could there be trouble with the Rachni? They were all but extinct. The last queen promised to disappear forever. Or be Probably destroyed. broke a promise. I know, I was there. I've got a bad feeling about this. It may not be Rachni. Maybe it is. Could be another invasion. If they're crawling out from under some rock, you know how bad it could get. We need to stop them. It's entirely possible that the rock may have been subverted by the um, collectors. Or whatever. What's the situation back on Tachanka? I'm still getting scattered reports of Reaper Reapers forces rather. arriving. Something big is brewing. I won't let those things take Tachanka. Not when we're about to cure the genophage. My people have had enough bad luck in our time. What will you do after the genophage is cured? Once we deal with the Reapers, most Krogan will want to settle a score with the Turians and Solarians. Yeah. I won't let them. That isn't our path forward. This time will be different. A lot of people will be relieved to hear that. No one wants to repeat history. They know we'd probably win this time. <laughs> But war has never brought us anything except misery. It's time to focus on rebuilding. And... No Krogan to talk about. Back on Sir Cash, it looked like the female Krogan could hold her own. Our females don't lack for spirit. For males, a good show of force sorts things out. But females like to talk about it. Then think about it. Then talk about it some more. No offense. <laughs> Believe it or not, we sometimes have good ideas, Rex. <laughs> yeah, but our women have so many of them. So sometimes I pretend to listen and... Well, let's just say Krogan females have tempers, too. Uh-huh. That's it for now, Rex. Let's get back to work. Anytime. And Shepard, I like what you've done with the Normandy. Got tired of always hanging around the cargo bay before. I still don't have a window like Liara does, but maybe that's because I don't kiss his Hey. <laughs> no 
for comment. Yeah. <laughs> I miss this place. Wish I could knock some heads around with you, but duty calls. If the Solarian says my DNA is important, who am I to argue? Rumble for that quest. Commander. You said one of your ships had gone missing. Crashed, actually. I couldn't speak in front of the Krogan. He's in the room, you know. Down on Chuchunka. Now they're pinned by an advanced guard of Reapers scouting the planet. What are your men doing there? I'm sorry. That's classified. It's kind of important for me to know if I'm going to go down there. It's vital they be rescued. They must complete their original mission. It's a matter of galactic peace. Uh huh. I'll do what I can. I appreciate your help and understanding. How are things on Palavan? The casualty reports are staggering. The Reapers are using our own tactics against us. Destroy the enemy with overwhelming force. I've seen the same on Earth. The strategist in me admires their brutality. The Turian in me knows I'm watching the destruction of 15,000 years of civilization. I just the Turians and the... My civilization. Um, Krogans visually look a lot like birds. The Krogan will make sure that doesn't happen. Assuming you're successful with the cure. We will be. You have to be, Commander. I don't want to go down as history's last Primarch. The Solarian Dalatras worries about what the Krogan will do once they're cured. How do you feel? It won't matter if we don't stop the Reapers, but I understand her doubts. The moon you found me on? That's where we made our last stand against the Krogan during the rebellions. They were that relentless. How did it turn out? The Krogan started using asteroids as weapons, directing them against our colonies. We had no choice. The genophage was our last resort. So yes, Krogan intentions after this war will be a serious concern, but I'd rather have a grateful ally than a resentful enemy. Reaching out to the Krogan for help is yeah. difficult for you. We can't allow the mistakes of our past to cloud the future. Your race and mine were once enemies. The first contact war, as you call it. I was there, dodging. You are fairly long lived. Navy. But look at us now, standing in a ship of Turian human design, working together. All right. I understand this is a difficult time for you, Primarch, but Earth can't survive without reinforcements. Can I still count on your help? If the Krogan help us on Palavan, then I give you my word. Good to hear. How is it being the Primarch? Not what I imagined. The battle of all time is happening on Palavan, and I'm light years away, reading casualty reports in the millions. If I'm going to die, I want to be with my men, so there's no doubt we fought to the last soul. I understand. Leaving Earth to save it, it's one of the hardest things I've ever done. I'm not surprised. Garrus speaks highly of That's you. good to hear. You never asked to be a leader. Yet your people will die if you refuse. We find ourselves in similar circumstances. Let's hope the spirits grant us the strength to see it through. That's all. Of course, Commander. There's a conference room. We've got new reports of Cerberus activity on Chuchunka. I've marked it on the galaxy map. And I got an email. Uh huh. Indoctrination. Major Curie.
Unlock the glyph. All right. All right, nothing else in the system. And we're full up on fuel. Scouts over there. Broken DMZ. Survivors. It's presence and also there is the surviving um forces of the of the shadow broker out there too Where am I headed? Renic system. Signal confirmed. Oh, crap. Cool. Reapers eluded. There we go. All right, my war asset, let's get out of here. Faster than light jump successful. All right. Ball. Get the survivors first, and then we'll check out uh, Cerberus. After this, we'll head back to the Citadel and chat with Barlavon. All right, let's bring Javik this time. I've brought him around for a while. Um, he's basically a um, Sonic. Garrus. Give you your particle rifle.
Bats are only max, so just need more ammo. Uh, let's up your creation. Ultralight materials, drop the weight, negligible amount. Up my damage, ups my ac ups the accuracy. or temperature barrel. Alright, and then Mantis Sniper Rifle. Much reduced capacity and lower fire rate, but a lot more damage and accuracy. I think that's his style. Drills. Oh. Alright, let's give this a shot. Points a little bit. Javik, I can level you the hell out of you. First three levels of each. Duration of damage over time. The target lets me hit him better. A lot of guys with armor and barriers that is used. Damage. And let's boost your health. And we're good. Okay. I gotta swap discs again. This is the one minus for a disc based game. I installed both discs and everything. Here we are. This crash site's a nightmare. Looks like Rex was right about Reaper scouts. Edie, any further intel? The mission brief identifies the Turian commander as Lieutenant Tarquin Victus. Victory on the mission, good. Victus? Primarch, son. Huh. Try to raise him. For a Turian commander, what happened here is... Let's just say the Turian code is not forgiving. And that it's his son is bad for the Primarch. Promoting family without merit can bite you in the ass. What's strange is the Primarch knows that. Commander, I have to land well back from the main crash site. Is that the best you can do? Yes, ma'am. The Reapers seem unaware of our presence. You might get the jump on them. 
All right, set her down. Let's save this platoon. I'm bringing a Prothean with us because we're fighting Reapers now. We might get some interesting banter here. Edie, did you raise Lieutenant Victus? Yes, but the connection is bad. Patch me in. This is Commander Shepard, Alliance Navy. Do you read? This is Lieutenant Tarquin Victus of the 9th Platoon. We're pinned by Reaper harvesters and taking heavy casualties. Also, there are pockets of my men scattered along the crash trajectory. Lieutenant, I need you to fire a flare so I can find your position. Got it. Things get worse by the minute. My men are dying. This sounds bad. Let's move. Very linear level design, but that's kind of expected. The designs in these games have always been kind of linear. Nicely done. We got new submachine gun. Okay, I have a visual on the enemy, and there's an escape pod just beyond. Looks like the Turians are in tough. Enemies up ahead don't know we're here. Surprise on our side for once. I like it. Exactly. Let's go. All right, and let's hit turn and rush. You have that. All right, that is effective on things with armor, so use that. Working on it. Some amp there was some ammo over here. They'll live to fight another battle. Okay. There's ammo over here, because I think I picked up grenades, but I didn't pick up 
bullets. All right. Keep moving. We need to find the main crash site ASAP. All right. Uh-huh. I'm hearing drones. Head. Working on it. with a grenade from here. Got it! Ha <laughs> ha! I think we should... That for killing... That achievement for killing a... Yes, for killing a harvester. Nice. Hang on a sec, I just leveled up. And I can't use any of those abilities yet. You have it, as your gear is, can. He can level up his concussive, he can level up his concussive shot. And Jevic doesn't have anything he can use yet. Here, what's your status? More armor. Commander, what's your ETA? Hang tight. We're on our way. Arnick, how's our velocity? Deceleration online. We'll survive. Victus is going to pay huh. for this. Court Marshal are hanging. How will the commander beat this down? When we find him, we'll ask. Shepard here. Just saw harvesters drop a lot of enemies in your path. Understood. Okay. First aid time. I realized we'd killed one of his buddies and thought perhaps maybe 
a better plan is in order. Alright, I need to... You got shields, let's... Got it? it? It sufficiently chastened? Oh, thank you. Okay. Let's pick it up. It's important we don't lose this squad. To hold the Krogan Maxim unproductive, all available forces should be mobilized at the city site. Krogan Turian animosity is ancient and intense in his form. And I need them to work together, so let's not complicate things. Yep. I'm gonna need those med kits because I just spent two of them healing your ass. <clears throat> Ammo upgrades, uh, equipment upgrades, that's good to see. Double attack for the extra damage.
Dark channel it again. It's still on armor. I'm still using ammo, which hurts. Shields and barriers. Fury ammo. Burn the bastard. Lieutenant Victus? Commander Shepard, my men and I are in your debt. Thank you for saving so many. What happened here? He screwed up. Stand down, soldier. These men are dead because of him. I said. Is a right behind the lead ears, Commander. Hey, I just saved all your asses, so everyone just calm down. Is a whip behind the ears, Commander. Lieutenant. What's going on here? I made a bad call. This is all on me. I chose caution and clever tactics over a head-on attack. And my men paid the price. You mean the crash? Yes. We could see on Hollow that Reaper forces were blocking our intended path. Staying on course guaranteed heavy casualties. So I chose a safer route, skirting the enemy. And that took us low and through these ruins. When we encountered resistance, there was no room to maneuver. Suddenly, we were in a fight for our lives. A lot of my men lost. Their Honestly, lives. a head-on attack would just gotten you blown, com blown completely the hell up. So, not your fault. Owning your mistake takes guts, but you have to get over it and move on. Of course, it's just fresh right now. Our mission's still a failure. When we've stabilized the injured, we'll head back to the fleet. You're abandoning your mission? We're down over thirty men. It'd be suicide. What exactly did you come here to do? There's a bomb on the planet. We were sent to defuse it. A bomb? How big? Enormous. Cerberus. Uh -huh. Lieutenant, if Cerberus has that bomb, you have to finish your mission. Haven't these men sacrificed enough? I understand. This kind of sacrifice is the hardest to ask for, but your men signed on for it. And, and so I'm coming you. along. My men have lost hope, Commander. Even if I wanted to finish the mission, they don't. It's your job to make them want to. How? Their sacrifice means that others will never face what they faced here today. Remind them that those sacrifices have no honor if the mission works. Fails. Men, I own what happened here today. But we have to carry on. No, we don't. Who cares about a few dead Krogan? It's over. We are Turi. And we will not let Cerberus succeed. Our sacrifice is the difference between life and death for this entire galaxy. Let the heroes of the Ninth Platoon be remembered for... I like the base residence for uh, three invoices. All right, men. Shuttle's arriving any minute. We're moving out. Commander? Darn Skippy, I am. We're a shell of what we were. We could use the help. Send me the nav point. I'll see what I can do. Thank you. That'll give us time to do a little recon. See what we're up against. Victus, you have a second chance here. Make their sacrifice count. Understood, Commander. Hope to see you at the rendezvous. So this is the other thing I've got the recon about. And yes, I will be there at the rendezvous. Sorry. Cerberus bomb. What the hell is going on, Commander? And what do the Turians have to do with it? Coordinates Victus gave me place it in the Kelphic Valley. It's a heavily populated area. That's all I know. My gut says something's not I right think here. I know what it is. What do you suggest? Get the Primarch to come clean. Should we alert the Krogan military? I'd wait. We're in the dark here. 
Krogan-Turian relations are fragile until the genophage is cured. Let's not push it. And how about this bomb? How many troops does Cerberus have on this? No idea. All I know is, we can't have them detonating that bomb. Keep me in the loop. Hack it out. Well, the other Cerberus mission I saw was directly related to this. Crimark Victus. Impressive work on Tuchanka. I'm grateful that... Why didn't you tell me about the Cerberus bomb? Why hide that? What else do you keep? It's a planet there? cracker. I have nothing for you. For our alliance to work, I need to trust you. Our friendship is new, Commander. Would you trust me with information that puts your people, puts Earth, at risk? Why would I jeopardize our alliance by lying to you now? It doesn't make sense. Decisions like these weigh heavy on me. When I was a general, I could pass them up the chain of command. But now, I'm all I've got. Know what I mean? Sure. And? And... And that's all. Wait, there is one more thing, Commander. Thank you for saving my son. Shepard, test verified. Results promising. Can synthesize for universal... Oh, that's great! Good. Then you can put your knife away. The cure is ready? No. Still need transmission vector. Cure useless unless given to entire species. You're usually full of ideas, Morden. You altered the genophage before. There must be a way. Of course. Always possibilities. But time limited. Can't create new infection strain from scratch. Groundwater? No. Too slow. Voluntary inoculation risky. Population too scattered for airborne. Unless... Wait! Yes! The Shroud. Constant global dispersion of air particles. Built by Salarians to repair atmosphere of Tuchanka. Also used by Turian. We used it to secretly spread the genophage virus. It ended the Krogan rebellions. I'd be careful who you tell that to. Yeah. Sometimes I understand why the Krogan want to shoot everyone in sight. <laughs> I love that he nods with that. <laughs> yes, yes, but useful now. Original genophage strain still in storage at Shroud Facility. Can use it as transmission vector. Then use Shroud to blanket Tuchanka with cure. You clever little bijack. That's our best shot, right there. Then finish your preparations and be ready to go, Morden. Of course. Ready when you need me. We'll be in Medbay with Eve until then. Commander, Admiral Anderson is available on VidCom. All right. So, I'm going to take a short little break. Do have a drink of water. And I'll be... All right, stop recording for a second. <laughs>